we're at the Hamilton Farmer's Market. I just found Hellhound Sauce. It's a Ghostbuster pepper uh, mustard that um, uh, I will be uh, opening and uh, doing a tasting review once I get home. Uh, you normally don't find hot sauce mustard around, so I had to grab it. Um, I think a little bit pricey, $18 for this, but um, I guess, you know, it probably costs the same if I ordered offline with shipping, so uh, we'll go try it at home. Got a bunch of ghost peppers. You get hellhound. It's hellhound sauce. It's a ghost pepper mustard. Um... Found it at the local farmer's market. On here it says, As you pass through the gates of hell, you will be greeted by the beast feared by all, Satan's best friend, Hellhound. His bite is as fierce as the bite of this delicious Caribbean mustard hot sauce, made with both habanero peppers and ghost peppers. When you first taste this, this sauce, you will think you died and went to heaven. <laughs> then, the burn will turn you on and make oh will turn on you not too, sorry <laughs> turn on you and make you feel like you're standing in the fires of hell holding on to hellhound's chains and wondering why <laughs> I'm just going to keep that in I don't really feel like redoing that um ingredients it's got you know your red wine vinegar uh there's a Dijon mustard, yellow mustard, um, uh, natural sugar, onions, habanero peppers, ghost peppers, garlic spices. Um, yeah, it's a pretty cool label actually too. So that's kind of what drew me to it. Not to mention you don't really find uh, any good spicy mustard anywhere, anyways. So. Didn't bring my knife with me. Oh, it smells so good. Well, it comes out. Sorry to the bug. It comes out quite fast. And yeah, you can see that. It smells so good. Mm. Wow, there's actual chunks of ghost pepper in there. There's, uh, you can taste the chunks of ghost pepper, there's little chunks of habanero. It's a nice smoky flavor. Really, if you like Dijon mustard and hot stuff, this is like, this is that. Perfect combination. Mmm, just nice heat. Wow, that is really good. Mm. Yeah, you can really taste the, the ghost pepper there. There's little chunks, like you chew on them, the flavor just comes right out. Um, wow. This would go great with my uh, ghost pe pepper uh, relish. Uh, okay, one second. Sorry, I'm back. Um, this is my ghost pepper relish I made. Ghost relish. Um, and actually, this little jar, I think I put, I think it contains like six, six ghost peppers, um, some red savinas. Um, I put a few uh, sweet red peppers in there too. I think it's like one and a half of those actually. That's it. Just to balance it out. I don't think it's going to make a difference. Um, it's just going to be really, really hot. Um, 
But yeah. I'll make some more of that later. But anyways, again, I I strongly suggest this. I give this uh, um, a 10 out of 10 for flavor. He, it just if you like mustard and you like hot hot stuff, <laughs> you'll love this because yeah, I'm probably gonna go through a lot of this. Anyways, until next time.